Hello there and welcome to the new tutorial of the Tableau course, Tableau Dates. And here we will going to talk about the date conversion function. So many times Tableau is not able to understand the date format because uh, it is not very much apparent for the Tableau or to its internal engine at what the date format is. And use with the use of the date conversion function, we can basically convert the given format into the specified format that uh, in which the date is coming. That way, we can then do all the date related calculation pretty easy. So let's go ahead in the tableau and see an example of how that format may look like, and then we can how we can convert that. All right, so here we are within Tableau and what we have is the year month and uh, this is the format which is present and Tableau is not able to understand whether it is a date format or not because as you can see it has given us like any other dimension or any other discrete value but not like a proper year. So how we can change this into a proper date. So for that I will click on the create calculated field. And over here, we will give it a name as date parse as we are parsing this day. However, you can give any name that is more relevant to the, your business context. So we will use the same function, which is date parse. Here, we will provide the format. So the format, if you see, we have 2016, which is the year, and then the 9, which is the month. And then you have 201610. So the format we will going to provide is the year month. So Y, 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 Y and capital M. Uh, right now I'm going to specify two times as we have it two times, but it will throw us some small error, which I will show you how you can rectify that. And then you will have the string, which is nothing but the year month column. So once we have this, we click apply and okay. We bring the dates over here right now it is aggregated at the year level but what we can do is change this back to day and uh, make it discrete so right now if, as i mentioned to you it has uh, taken those dates where you have two letters but those which are with one letter has been ignored so what can be done in this case well a uh, very simple thing which you can do is go into the edit mode and just remove 1M over here and click apply and OK. And that way you will get all those values where just the one month that has been present. Another is uh, you have two character values, which is 10, 11, 12 and so on and so forth for the rest of the years that is also present. So this way we can at first we have to understand what is a format in which date is coming and then we provide the same date format to the date parts. And then by default, it will going to show you the values in a normal date format, which you can then manipulate, aggregate, deaggregate as per your needs. And as you would have observed, the date that it will going to pick is the first of that month. So that's about how you can use the date parse function for doing the conversion of dates within the Tableau to help Tableau understand dates easily and as well as help you to make the date related calculation in a normal way. So that's about it for the date conversion using the date parse function. In the next topic, we will be looking at the rolling dates.